All right, uh, first things first, no, issue, no issues coming out of practice. Um, Calvin Ridley had a little slight ankle issue. He was out for a little bit and then came back. He's fine. Uh, nobody else really with any issues uh, to report of, so we should be good to go on the injury front. Uh, really awesome to be here. It was really cool to see uh, the fans in the stadium have a little energy. I know the players felt it. Uh, really meant a lot to be able to get out here and then have the fans out here supporting us. So uh, thanks to the fans for all that are listening and reading. It was, it was awesome to have you guys out here. Uh, with that, go ahead. Uh, back and forth. I thought it was back and forth today. I think there was some good things uh, offensively in the base down period we did. And uh, I thought the defense did some good stuff on third down. They're really, they're really a pain in the butt on third down. And uh, it was good for us. We did all that work, all the blitz pickup and all the disguised coverages. They do a good job. So it's a challenge for us offensively. Uh, we made a couple of plays. They made a couple of plays. And uh, that was, that was kind of how a good, good football team should be in practice. So uh, I was, yeah, back and forth would be the best way to put it. You know, I think we got to be better. Our, we got to be firmer in protection. It's obviously hard without pads on. You know, we're not really anchoring on guys. And um, but you know, I think we just got to execute better. Um, I thought we missed a couple throws that we could have had. I know Will had a touchdown on a deep ball, and the ball slipped out of his hand. So that one wasn't any fun. But we had a shot. Um, but yeah, it was good. We just a lot of things. We're, we're four days in. We got plenty of stuff to work on, and um, you know, that's why we're practicing. That moved the ball. Yeah. Uh, that was a third. That was a third down period. So those were all third downs. Um, yeah, the ball came out of his hand bad. We had a shot at the route. Um, didn't do a great job in, in protection on two of those, I think. And you know, it wasn't our best day on third down. And again, Denard presents a lot of problems, and the defense did a good job. So, um, from my point, that's good to see. And offensively, we got some things to clean up. Yeah, I mean, we, we're still we still reinstall, so we're you know five five installs in at this point, and so um, yeah, we, we wanted to have a couple of things to have some fun with, you know, to see if we get the fans excited. And we had a few, uh, but Denar's got a few things too that makes life hard, and he wasn't gonna gonna go lay down easy for us. So uh, that part was was good to see from that end. That throw along the sideline to Tony was next level. Well, that's yeah, that was a really nice throw, really nice route by Tony out of the backfield. Um, that was good to see. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna move our formation. We're gonna move our players all over the place. Uh, Pre-snap motion is a big part of what we do um, and how we manipulate the defense. And so that's definitely gonna be part of um, what you see uh, come Sundays. Is is we're gonna move the formation a lot with a lot of different people. So that was a, a sampling of, of some of the things that that we've been practicing and working on. Yeah, uh, you know, two young corners um, that are really exciting to, to watch. But I think, um, you know, Judy Lolly's got got a little bit of stickiness to him, which is fun. Uh, you see some some natural cover ability. Um, all those guys have stepped in and done a nice job. Bromley's playing between the nickel and the outside corner. So uh, he's got a lot on his plate. So it's good to see these young guys get exposure uh, to the NFL. I mean, those, those guys haven't played any NFL football yet, um, but they got huge opportunities in front of them, which is good to see. Mm hmm. Yeah, there's a there's 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 still a time and a place to stress. We stress these guys mentally as far as the scheme goes. Um, we install a lot. There's a lot of football uh, in that part's probably stressful. Um, you know, specifically, I can't comment on guy to guy, but I would say, you know, I know Will said that the other day, and um, I, to me, I took it as he feels less stressed as a as a second year player. Not as many things to worry about um, that you are as a rookie. It feels more comfortable. So um, I can't speak to all of them, but. Uh, hopefully they're still a little stressed. That's a good thing. Stress makes you grow, so there'll be some of that. Uh, it was it was really cool. I mean, I've not had many moments where you know it feels real, and this felt made it feel real for um, you know a, a taste of it at least of what it feels like to walk out here on Sundays. Um, we'll get a couple shots in the preseason to do it as well, but um, it's exciting. It, it was really fun to come out and be the head coach of this football team and in front of these fans, it, it meant a lot.
yeah, Landry should be ready to go by, by next week. He just, anytime you have an illness of the type where you're, you're losing a lot of weight, you're just making sure we're getting back and don't want to put him in harm's way. So he should be good to go for next week. Yeah, they've done a nice job so far. I mean, they're veteran players, guys that have played a lot of football. So uh, just getting getting the names and faces and routines down. But uh, Jamal's been – I've been impressed with Jamal to start. Um, he looks pretty good. And then uh, Shane I've, I've known for a long time and, and have followed his career a bit. So uh, it's good to have him out here. Um, but they're, they're getting used to things and hopefully get a chance to play a little faster and freer as they get down the scheme a little bit further. Yeah, that's, um, that's a little showcase of what Tony's capable of. He's, he runs routes and catches the ball like a receiver. Uh, he, he runs the ball as, as good as any running back and uh, makes him a really threatening piece on offense that you have to account for uh, in all phases of the offense. And um, that's just a, a little piece of, of what he's capable of helping us do. Yeah, really, really pleased with Malik. Uh, I think both those quarterbacks have really done a nice job. And uh, Malik came out and had a nice day with some aggressive throws. Um, he's really done a nice job knowing what to do, uh, where to go with the football, and uh, really pleased with how he played today. It was a good day for Malik.